Welcome to Tuesday's Tips from So Very Easy. My name is Laura and let's talk about ironing out those nasty wrinkles. The wrinkles that are pretty much set in there and you think you're never going to get those wrinkles out. Well, the first thing you need to do is relax those fibers and iron them once. And to do that, just take plain water. I like to use distilled water because I can keep it in my bottle and I don't need to worry about it. And what you need to do is re-dampen your fabric. You do not need to soak it, you just need to dampen it. And once it's been damp, let it sit. This is the hardest part. I know we will want to hit the iron to it right away. But what will happen is when you iron it, you're just rolling the water right off. The fabric hasn't had a chance to relax or absorb the water. And when the fabric absorbs the water, it sort of swells up a little bit and it becomes soft and it relaxes. When the fabric is relaxing, just take your hands and smooth it as flat as you can as it is relaxing. And just that movement alone is going to help some of the wrinkles come out. And if you think what a wrinkle is going to look like in the fabric, a wrinkle is the fabric coming up to a point like this. So if you were to iron that point, you're just going to iron the wrinkle back in. So you need to flatten the fabric so that you don't iron the wrinkle in. And to do that, it's very easy. Just take your hand and smooth the fabric before the iron. So I'm going to move my hand as I'm moving the iron. And that way, I'm kind of giving that wrinkle a chance to flatten out. Now you might have to do this a couple of times until the wrinkles are really out. Then after that you're going to be able to press it with whatever your favorite starch or your starch alternative is. And then you're going to do it the same way. Spray it with what you want and then again let it sit for a couple of minutes so the starch or the starch alternative can have a chance to soak into the fibers so that you're just not ironing that starch or the alternative starch off of the fabric. Then you're able to just press it like you would normally do. Again you might need to put your hand in front of the iron as you press it and by doing that you should be able to get out all of those nasty wrinkles. Thank you for joining me today on So Very Easy. Feel free to subscribe. And as always, come on back. And let's see what we're sewing next time in the sewing room. Bye for now.